Hello everyone, we welcome you at Swear Talk Show where we invite the personality from gems and jewelry industry and know more about them and their brand. I just 2024 where we are celebrating the 40th edition of India International Jewelry Show. World's second last gem jewelry show scheduled from 8th to 12th of August at Geo World Convention Center and from 9th to 13th of August at Bombay Exhibition Center, Mumbai. Experience the pinnacle of luxury, innovations and craftsmanship where I just mark four takers of excellence in the industry. Discover exclusive collections, network with the global leaders and be a part of this monumental event in the heart of India to be sector Mumbai. Also, do not forget to explore the select club featuring the Couture Jewelry at Jasmine Hall, third floor at Geo World Convention Centre, Mumbai. Let's welcome Mr. Vinod Tejwani, Managing Director, Pranda Jewelry Private Limited. So, hello Vinod Ji, we welcome you at Swear Dog Show. How are you doing today? All good, all good. How's you? Everything is good. Thank you so much, Vinod Ji. Um, you know, since IHS 2024 is just around the corner, and as we all know, that uh, IHS has completed this four decades. Uh, in what ways the show have contributed the growth of Prima Art brand? For well, Prima Art brand, we have been uh, showcasing this since 2007, and I think every year the show has surpassed its past. So I think it has been a wonderful experience with us for IHS and over a period of time the infrastructure has been better, the visitors have grown, the quality of buyers have been fantastic year on year. So I think this is a wonderful venue for exhibiting at IHS. Uh, IHS Prima will be holding as two venues this year like uh, Bombay Exhibition Centre and Your World Convention Centre. Uh, what strategic advantage do you anticipate with this decision of GJPC? And how do you feel about your presence at Bombay Exhibition Center? Uh, I think both the locations are great. Both have its own advantage as well as disadvantage. Advantage, if you say, the beauty of the infrastructure is at Geo Convention Center. It has wonderful parking space. Whereas uh, Nesco has been around on a grand scale. So you have big booths here. And the visitors of uh, Nesco has been good enough. The footfall has been wonderful. But uh, I would say that the scale of uh, Nesco is far greater than the Geo Convention Center. Um, this year, the theme is Brilliant Bharat. It is highly relevant to the current jewelry landscape that we have. Uh, how do you plan to showcase the diversity and the brilliance of Indian craftsmanship and heritage to your collection at Prima Art? Well, when you say brilliant Bharat, Bharat has always been brilliant. And uh, when you say the showcase, uh, the Indian culture and heritage which goes along with it, number one, we have to understand that we are the best craftsmen of the world. So, Indian jewellery industry has one of its own craftsmanship in the world. And uh, as far as Prima Art is concerned, we use the best, finest, pristine craftsmanship with human touch and the state of art technology. And uh, what new are we going to experience at uh, Prima Art this year at IHS Prima? We always keep on evolving. We come up with new collection. The new collections are always better than what we have done in the past. And of course, this year also, we will be coming up with a very new uh, pieces. We also need to understand that uh, there is a growing age group that has been coming up at this exhibition show. So we have to cater to this millennial and Gen Z which is coming up. So we have uh, uh, drawn up our collection according to the age group that is coming up uh, in India. Right. So I think this is what we are focusing accordingly. Okay. As the jewelry industry is rapidly uh, growing, the, the technology getting influenced a lot in the manufacturing market, uh, how do you see the impact and the benefit of IGJME? having a continent show with the IHS Premier in shaping the jewellery industry future. As far as uh, gems and jewellery industry along with technology is concerned, a uh, major part of uh, jewellery industry goes for technology or technological innovation. And of course, having the 
machinery show along with it goes hand in hand so that uh, the manufacturers also understand what is coming up in the market what are the technologies that can be involved in manufacturing jewelry so it is obviously a fantastic platform to have both of them together all right and with increasing competition from the international jewelry shows uh, how do you believe i just maintain its unique positions and appeal on the global platform I think IIJS is very unique. We should not compare IIJS to other international jewelry shows because uh, IIJS is related to India. It is related to brilliant India. So it reflects the craftsmanship that we have and the craftsmen who showcase the product line to the world. So I think it is it does it is unfair to compare IIJS uh, with other jewelry shows. Of course, it has its own advantage. It has its own target audience. That is the biggest uh, difference that makes us stand apart from others. All right. And any message you would like to give to the visitors who are attending IIJS premiere show? Well, the visitors have to be welcome. We all wait for you. And every year, every booth, every manufacturer showcases its, its best product line. So it is obvious that this is the best platform that you can see the best collections of each and every participant. So, lovely. Well, with this, we come to an end of this interactive session. Vinoji, it was really nice talking to you. Thank you so much for your time. Same here. Thank you so much, and wishing you all the best for the IG. Thank you so much. Looking forward to see you at the show. See you, sir. Thank you so much. Well, ladies and gentlemen, you were listening to Mr. Vinod Tejwani, MD, Branda Jewelry Private Limited. Do not give it a miss. I just 2024 premiere is here, where business happens. We'll be back soon with more such interesting conversation with the leading personalities of our gems and jewelry industry. Until then, I am Ed Sharma. Sign off. Take care. God bless.